It's true you know about Rimmer. Do you rank below all four of those service robots, even the one that's gone absolutely mad? <laughs> well, this is a lot for long, matey. Up, up, up. That's where I'm going. Not until you pass your engineer's exam. And you won't do that because you'll just go in there and flunk again. Lister, last time I only failed by the narrowest of narrow margins. You what? You walked in there, Rose. I am a fish. 400 times with a funny little dance and fainted? That's a total lie. No, it's not. Peterson told me. No, it's not. Peterson told me. Lister, if you must know, what I did was I wrote a discourse on porous circuits which was simply too radical, too unconventional, too mold-breaking for the examiners to accept. Yeah, he said you were a fish. <laughs> Is that a cigarette you're smoking, Lister? No, it's a chicken. Right, you're on report. Two times in as many minutes, Lister. I don't know. Rimmer, Lister? Yes, sir. Yo, Todd Hunter, get down! Indeed. Now, uh, Rimmer, I'm just going through McIntyre's artifacts, and I see that you've filed 247 complaints against Lister. <laughs> yes, sir. That's 123 counts of insulting a superior technician. 39 counts of dereliction of duty, 84 counts of general insubordination, and one count of mutiny. Yes, sir. <laughs> mutiny, Lister? I stood on his top. Maliciously and with intent to wound. It was an accident. <laughs> Lister, I put it to you. How is it possible to stand on one small toe by accident? You didn't stand on my toe at all. You stood on my entire foot, thereby obstructing a superior technician in pursuit of vital duty. But the vital duty was him going to snap my guitar in half. Whereupon you leapt from the top bunk onto the whole of my right foot. All right, that's Had there been a crisis situation, Lister, I would have had to perform my duties hopping. Clearly putting the ship at risk, clearly therefore mutiny. Finished? However, I'm not a vindictive man, so I don't intend to apply for the death penalty. There are 169 people on board this ship. You, Rimmer, are over one man. Why can't you two get on? You see, I try, sir. I'm not an insubordinate man by nature. I try and respect Rimmer and everything, but it's not easy because he's such a smeghead. <laughs> Did you hear that, sir? Lister, do you have any conception of the penalty for describing a superior technician as a smeghead? <laughs> oh, Rimmer. <laughs> you are a smeghead. <laughs> We respect so your career's over. Todd, I think I finished your big league. Yeah.